Do I have to install a Euroclass compliant data cabling in data cabling installation? Euroclass cables and data or fiber optic cabling in which these standards are affected. Euroclass cable. The requirement to install a Euroclass cable is to be compliant with BS 6701 to 2016 plus A1 to 2017. Therefore if you are not installing to this standard then the non-compliance is advised to be notified to the building owner. In such cases, a fire safety report can be undertaken under BS 9999 to look at ways to mitigate the risks. Communication cable. Assembly of suitably insulated coaxial conductors or twisted pairs of insulated conductors fabricated to meet transmission, mechanical and environmental requirements. Furthermore sufficient to allow conveyance of information between two points with the minimum of radiation. Optical fiber cable. Assembly comprising one or more optical fibers or fiber bundles thus contained inside a common covering designed to protect them against mechanical stresses and other environmental influences. In addition, retaining the transmission quality of the fibers. What is BS 6701 to 2016 plus A1 to 2017? This is the British standard associated with cabling and telecommunications equipment. It creates specifically a link from UK electrical installation standards and how they apply to the cabling equivalents. To begin with, it references telecommunication cables and their reaction to fire performance in regards to CPR, construction products regulation. For new installations and the refurbishment or extension of existing installations within the external fire barrier of the building, installation cables which are subject to the CPR shall as a minimum meet the requirements of Euroclass CCA, S1B, D2, A2. To illustrate this the product sheet from the Excel cabling brand manufacturer highlights these changes and standards, CPR and BS 6701 to 2016 plus A1 to 2017 at a glance. What is CPR? Specifically the construction projects regulation aims to break down technical barriers and provide a common technical language. Thus to assess the performance of construction products and to harmonize the rules for marketing these products. Four key concepts of CPR, a system of harmonized technical specifications. A framework of notified bodies. A system of conformity assessment for each product family. CE marking of products. Why is LS0H no longer enough? Low smoke, zero halogen, LS0H, cables were designed to meet three IEC standards, 1. IEC 60332, flame spread. 2. IEC 60754, smoke acidity. 3. IEC 61034, smoke emission. The CPR applies additional criteria and testing procedures to promote a more harmonized standard to describe a cable's reaction to not fire. Are all cable types required to comply? The CPR applies to all permanently installed cables within a building, communication, power, and control cables in fixed installations. There is no distinction between copper and fiber, or shielded and unshielded cables. The only exception is patch leads, which are not within the scope of CPR. So, which CPR Euroclass cable should you choose? Different member states require different CPR classification levels for various applications. Furthermore, member states may implement the standard in line with their regional requirements. For instance, hospitals require a B2CA rating in some countries, but only a CCA rating in others. In this case, to achieve standards compliance in the UK, it is important to choose a cable with a CPR Euroclass of a minimum of CCA, S1B, D2, A2 is stipulated in BS 6701 to 2016 plus A1 to 2017. Likewise, this applies to any new installations or the refurbishment and or extension of existing installations within the external fire barrier of the building. 
therefore it is always advisable to always check with the country's local regulations. Where can I locate the requirements of the standard compliant Euroclass cable? Product data sheets. Product packing labels. Cable sheath printing. Price differences of Euroclass cable. CCA and B2CA Euroclass cable due to their superior fire rating and naturally a more expensive material acquisition than the standard LSOH cable or PVC versions. In some cases, this may be 30 to 40% of cable material costs. If comparable quotes show one to be significantly lower in price it's advisable to check that the correct cable specification has been quoted. For further assistance or a free survey, please email or call on the details below, and click like and subscribe if you have enjoyed this video.